People will sometimes get mixed up between magic and mentalism, and I'm going to prove that the two things are different. But first, um, has anyone got a coin, like a size of like a tempi coin that they're happy to write on? No? You have any? You got tempi? Tempi? Are you happy to write on it? Yeah, yeah, right, okay. So I've got, um, I've got a sharpie. I want, you, I want you to write your initials on both sides, okay? Right, now, whilst you do that, I want to tell you that uh, the reason I get you to sign the coin is because later on, when I do something, I don't know what I'm going to do, do something impressive with it, you'll recognise that coin and you'll, and you'll know, you know that it's your coin, yeah? Because yeah. that's just make it unique. And that means no other coin looks like this in the world, okay? So I'll put that back in there. Now, I've got a little envelope somewhere in here. Where is that little envelope? Got one. Here. Right. Got it. Now, I've got, I've got, I've got the envelope here. Now, I'm going to put your coin in the envelope like this. Make it dry. Right, I'm going to put your coin inside this envelope, yeah? I'll just put it in like that. Now, you can see your coin in there like that. You can see your coin? See your coin? Right. I'm going to seal your envelope, okay? Like this. Right. Right, like that. Seal your envelope. So now it's sealed, and uh, there's no way that's going to be getting anywhere. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that coin uh, somewhere where you can see it, and I want you to watch that um, coin. So I'm just going to put that in there. You'll watch that envelope, okay? Now, uh, somewhere in here, I've also got a little something else. I've got this, right, this. This is what I'm looking for. This, I've got a little bag. No, I've got this. Right, so the mentalism is a form of predicting. It's basically like predicting things. Now, um, here I've got a little pad with all my different favorite, uh, all my favorite sweets on. Like you can see, we've got I don't know, blackjack. Oh, I forgot what they're called. Um, candy canes. We've got candy canes here. Licorice. Uh, uh, dragon teeth. Um, gummy hearts. So there's loads of different things. Yeah? yeah? Now what I'd like someone to do is just lift it up like that, okay? So just grab it and like, just grab it and like, do that, okay? So who wants to do that? Uh, do you want to do it? Do you want to just, what are you going to do is you just want to lift it up like that. Don't let anyone say it, just like, yeah. Got it? I did it, remember it? Got it? Yeah, remember that. Now, I've got this bag here. Now inside this bag there's a jar of um, a type of sweet. Now you can pick anything, and that's been in there the whole time. You can pick anything, yeah? Right, in the last year of voice, what was the sweet that you picked? Now what's impressive is the jar is actually for a gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> now, that's me going. Now that's mentalism. Now magic is something else. Like you can see, we, we predicted that the jar of jelly beans would be here, but magic is a way of making things disappear and appear somewhere else, like the your coin has been in there the whole time. If I just do this, everyone chat happy down on the cat three. One, two, three. And now there is no coin. Coin's completely gone. And you're probably wondering where your coin went. Well the your coin went. You know the jar that's been there the whole time? Inside there. The jar. Why don't you it? There's a little thing you can put on there. You see that? You see that? I'm just going to give it a little gentle pull on it. You can see attached to that right there. The jelly bean's down. There's a touch to that right there. There's a coin. Take the coin off. Can you confirm that? That, that is your son coin. That's your son coin. Thank you.